Hey, what is up everyone? I'm Star Lords, and today we're going to be taking a little look at the achievements that you can get on the PC, the PS4 and the Xbox One for the up and coming Nuka World DLC. Okay, so guys, I must warn you that there is not exactly any big like kind of spoilers here, so do not worry about that if you don't want to get the DLC spoiled. Okay, so let's get into the first DLC image. Okay, so let's start off with the first one, and as you can see right here on screen right now, it is called Taken for a Ride, and it simply says Complete Taken for a Ride, which will be a quest, and it seems to have the Vault Boy actually tiptoeing past these bear traps with... I don't exactly know who that is in the background, I am assuming that it's just a random raider, so that is pretty cool, so that is our first achievement. Let's move on to our second, which is this one right now, and as you can see it's called The Grand Tour, and you know, it says complete the Grand Tour with, you know, you um, in some kind of raider clothing with two other raiders and a little flag, so what I'm thinking is, you know, they've actually shown you around the park, and you're now initiated into their little gang, so that's pretty cool too. Going back again, we have one called Home Sweet Home, and it just simply says Complete Home Sweet Home. And it looks like the Vault Boy kicking another Vault Boy, I guess. And judging by the actual name, I would say that maybe you have to go back into Sanctuary and take it over, you know, kill a couple of people, or, you know, just simply take over Sanctuary as a raider, that's what it seems like to me, but you know, if you guys have any other suggestions, please leave a comment. So let's move on to our next achievement. Okay, so this next one is pretty cool, it is called Eyes on the Prize, and it has got the Vault Boy holding a bunch of tickets, and as you know, we can actually play the mini games in Nuka World, and it simply says, redeem 100,000 tickets at the Nuka Cade, which I said at the start, I said you probably have to use these little mini games to actually acquire weapons such as, you know, the paddle ball and stuff like that. If that is the case, that is freaking awesome, 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 it's awesome, and yeah, I definitely cannot wait for that. Let's move on. This next one is called Power Play, and it simply says Complete Pla Power Play, which will be another quest, and I'm kind of thinking that maybe, it may be that part in the trailer where you see that, um, that new kind of... A, you know kind of power suit getting like vaulted up and stuff like that Maybe it's something to do with that, but again, we don't really know moving on We have this next one called beverage year or beverage. Yeah, I don't really know but this one is especially exciting It says create 20 different flavors of nuka cola, which that kind of blows my mind, you know, we will be able to do multiple flavors of this actual brand, and that is insane, I cannot wait to see what I come up with, and obviously, they will have some kind of effects of them, and you know, you just gotta experiment, so be sure to check my channel for when that actually comes out, I will have a lot of different recipes for certain things. Moving on, we have one called Raiding for a Living, complete 12 quests for any Nuka World Raider gangs, so any Nuka World Raider gangs, it seems like there's going to be multiple Raider gangs in Nuka World, so maybe we actually have to faction with whichever one we would like, you know, maybe we don't have access to all of them, which is pretty interesting actually, and it just shows, you know, the Vault Boy holding a load of caps, I guess that is, so yeah, very interesting, tell me what you think in the comments. So let's moving on, we have Diberian, Diberian, and it says collect every issue of Scav magazine, which I am especially excited about, I love hunting for these magazines across the land in Fallout, I especially loved it in Far Harbor where they brought in all of the new ones, and I definitely will have a lot of guides for that as soon as the DLC launches, I will have all of them ready for you in a little guide in which you can find, and obviously it's just got the, the Vault Boy looking at his Scav magazine with a little bit of a cheesy smile smiler, little sexy fuck, but uh, let's move on, we have Hostile Takeover, which says, establish eight raider camps in the Commonwealth, which, yeah, we kind of said in the, in the one called Home Sweet Home, I guess you just have to take back over your, um, you know, your additional settlements and make them into a raider camp, which is really cool, I cannot wait to do that, definitely not. Uh, so, moving on to the very last achievement that we will get in this DLC, it is called all sugared up, and it says, defeat 
40 Nuka World creatures while under the effect of any Nuka mix flavor. So I said you will have multiple mixes of these drinks and they will have different effects of them. And here of course it has the Vault Boy holding up a gun, a cult it looks like, and he's drinking his, I guess that's a strawberry Nuka Cola, and he looks kind of crazy eyed. So that is especially exciting guys, to be honest, those achievements have me very hyped indeed, I definitely kind of wait for this DLC, as you know, it's the very last DLC, which I will have a video on later on uh, this week, sorry about my phone, but yeah, some of you guys actually don't believe that this is the last DLC, so I think I just better do a video actually addressing it, and a friend request off PS4, thank you to whoever that was. Um, anyway guys, thank you all for watching, I do hope that you're hyped about these achievements as much as I am, and if you are, please leave a comment in the comments section and tell me. And until next time, I've been Star Lord. Uh, see ya! Bethesda. That is a fucking DLC. That is what we needed throughout...